Brad Nessler joined by the coach, Lee Corso, and the quarterback, Kirk Herbstreet. It's a picture-perfect day as we get set for today's contest between the Boston College Eagles and the Fighting Irish of Notre Dame. We're set to bring you this relatively young rivalry in which the winner takes home the Ireland Trophy. And here comes the Fighting Irish. The Eagles seem to have the better team. They should win this game. What do you think, Kirk? Boston College has a game-breaking player on defense, and he only gets better with every game. Tackles can't block him, and quarterbacks fear him. That alone will be a big factor in why I think they will win this game today, Coach. Oh, Kirk. There's a chance I might even agree with you on this one. He was going to close him. kicking off and you can just feel the energy in the air for this opening kickoff kicks it off number one fields it at the seven today we get to watch a spectacular athlete at running back when he's on the field as he is right now Defenses really have to tailor their game plan for him. He's a heck of a player, and I really believe that he could have a huge game today. That makes two of us then. I just don't know if there's enough talent on this defense, especially at linebacker, to compete with such a great running back. Well, I guess we'll just have to wait and see. And he's taken down. Now, that was a good-looking play. The quarterback put it where his receiver could get it, and now they have a first down. What I like is the faith that this quarterback has in his receiver. He's not afraid to throw it downfield. First and ten. Ball on the 40-yard line. The Eagles come out showing three wide. Nice play, Baker. And it's incomplete. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 40. Setting up the play action. He's going right. Incomplete. He had his wide out, but he couldn't hit him. When he misses, it's usually high. And that's something he's been working very hard with his coach on. It's third down and 10. Ball on the 40-yard line. Defense lines up with six DB. He drops back. Steps up in the pocket. Wants to throw outside. His receiver has it. And he's brought down. So on third down, they pick up the first and a lot more. When that kid caught the ball, he wasn't thinking about first down. He was thinking touchdown. scrimmage. They'll give it off here. Ajupu, and they make the stop. Four-yard gain by the back. Let's see if they can take this one in for six. Let's see if they can 
punch this one in. Tacks on the extra point. Let's take a glance now at the Pontiac drive summary. Looks ready to kick this one off. He sends this one deep. Number 28 fields it in the end zone. And now a slight break in the action as the offense comes out onto the field for their next possession. They'll go to work at the 21-yard line. Single set backfield. On the ground with a tailback. Tries to juke. Brought down. A five-yard pickup for the tailback. It's second down and five to go. Ball on their own 26. Back to pass. He steps up. Looks. Wants to throw outside. Got it to the senior. He picks up a yard on the play. One yard gain on the play. Third down and four coming up on this one. Ball on the 27-yard line. The Irish come to the line with their jumbo packing. Drops back to pass. Down the middle. Someone got a hand on it. Well, that was an impressive stand by the defense. Three good defensive plays equals punt. Nice job, guys. Fourth and four. Ball on the 27 yard line. They line up to punt this one away. He gets it away. Number one takes it at the 32. He jukes. At the 40. Inside the 30. To the 20. Goodbye. Touchdown, Boston College. They got the kickoff, but they forgot to play coverage. It was like they would just stand around watching. Horrible job of coverage there. And he hits the PAT. Over two minutes remaining in the first quarter. The score is Boston College, 14, Notre Dame, nothing. Ready to kick. Nice kick. Plenty of distance. Number 20. Fields it in the end zone. You guys remember what this offense did the last time they had the ball? Did they have the ball before? Exactly. It was three and out so fast they had to ask for slow-mo replay to recap it. They'll start this drive at the 16-yard line. There's a fumble. 
Number 74 recovers a loose ball. The offense will keep possession after the fumble by the running back. It's a good thing they can't afford a turnover right now. Second and 11 coming up. Ball on the 15-yard line. Tackled a two yard run by the halfback. Gain of two on the play. It's third down and nine to go. Ball on their own 17. Six DBs in the lineup. He drops back with the throw. Someone got a hand on it. That ball should have been picked off. This quarterback had too much faith in his arm that time. Well, that confidence almost led to a change of possession. His man wasn't even close to being open. The Fighting Irish line up to punt. He gets it off. And this one's going to go out of bounds at the 38-yard line. Great passing was the key for the offense the last time they had the ball. They were able to pick apart the defense and get down the field for a touchdown. So if I'm the coach, I'm telling my defensive lineman to get more pressure on that quarterback, please. Four wide. It's a direct snap. And he's taken down. That's a three-yard pickup. Second and seven. Ball on the 32-yard line. Boston College comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. Back to pass. Rolls right. Looking across the middle. Got it. And they make the stop. Nice decision by the quarterback. Not only was it good decision making, but the offensive line protected just long enough for him to find his target. And when you combine the two, it'll be a first down nine out of ten times. Boston College lines up with three receivers. Pitch left. He's into the open field. And down he goes. And that'll be a gain of ten by the running back. Come out with three wide receivers. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Brought down. Looks to have been shaken up a bit on that play. Well, it doesn't look like it's too serious, guys, but you never know. Sometimes those small injuries turn into seizing ending ones. Crowd in that line of scrimmage. The gives to the fullback. Oh, what a move. And they make the stop. Two-yard carry by the fullback. Boston College, 14, Notre Dame, nothing. Number 15, and four receivers lined up here. They hand it off. There's a missed tackle, and they got him for a loss. The halfback couldn't get any running room. And that was because the defense had called a blitz just at the right time. He went right through the offensive line and nailed him for a loss. It's power football time, folks. run him again and he's taken down he plows ahead for a two-yard game this isn't much more than an extra point it's 
gets up, and it's right down the middle. That score leads us to our Pontiac drive summary. Like they're ready for the kickoff. Kicks it deep. Number 20. Fields it in the end zone. Not a very good series for this offense on their last drive as they were forced into a three and out. Boy, oh boy, they had nothing going last time. Yeah, maybe, Scooter, you need to get out there and show them what you're made of. Somebody get me a helmet quickly. Brought down. That was a pretty good run. Incredible effort there, running the football by this guy. First and ten. Ball on the 33. Notre Dame goes with the ace set here. Throw short. Complete. Tackle. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed, and the result is a first down. It's first and 10. Ball on the 49-yard line. And this impact receiver is looking to make a play. He's in the zone. Makes a move. They'll bring him down. They'll get two on that one. On the run, gain of two on the play. It's second down and eight to go. Ball right around midfield. The Irish line up with three wide. Drops back to pass. Throws it to the outside. He's hit and got away. Way to look it in. Nice catch. Sure was. He displayed some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. First and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. Two tight ends here. He drops back. Across the middle. The senior makes the catch. And he's tackled. That's a gain of eight. Second and two coming up here. And this is the sixth play of the drive. Let's see if they look the wideouts way. He is in the zone. They go with a pitch to the right. Touchdown, Notre Dame. Very impressive run by the halfback to find the end zone. Good play call here by the offensive coordinator. He realizes when you get down into the red zone and you have a halfback like this, just give it the ball and let him find his way into the end zone. on the extra point. So under three minutes to go in the second quarter and the score, Boston College, 17, Notre Dame, 7. Notre Dame, ready to kick this one off. Number one and number 84, deep to return. He kicks it. Number 
84. Fields at the goal line. The offense ready to go again. And their last drive ended with three points. They'll get the ball here at the 17. Number 15 comes to the line with three wide. out of bounds and that was a nice run Kirk that was a great job by that big offensive line yeah it really was Brad and also a nice read by the ball carrier to find that running lane when you break one like that you got to give a lot of credit to the offensive line first and ten ball on their own 35 the Eagles go with the eye formation Brought down. Maybe a yard on the run by the tailback. No gain on the play. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 35. If they're not careful, this impact corner is going to make them pay. Wants to throw outside. And he brings it down. So they execute, move a little closer to the sticks. Yeah, completing those short passes is the key because it lulls the defense to sleep a little bit. Then you can launch one big one downfield for a big game. It's third down and three to go. Ball on the 42-yard line. They line up in an eye. And off to the fullback. And he's taken down. Notre Dame calls a timeout. the punt punts the ball away number 20 calls for the fair catch and they make the fair catch at the 17 the offense with a lot of success through the air on that last drive as they moved it down the field for the touchdown they'll take over at the 17 yard line and he's going to be sacked for a loss so one of the veterans on this defense gets in there for the sack. They've got to do a better job of protecting their quarterback. Yeah, he can't afford to take too many more hits like that. It's second down now, 14 to go. Ball on the 13-yard line. High formation here. There's a play fake. Throws this one out to the left. And he brings it down. And he's tackled. Move those sticks. That's a first down. And a great catch, too. Did you see how he looked that one in? Well, there's no doubt about it. He can catch the football. Ten. Ball on their own 44. One man backfield. They'll throw on first down. He's looking. Throws it to the outside. He's knocked out of bounds. Nice decision by the quarterback. Not only was it good decision making, but the offensive line protected just long enough for him to find his target. And when you combine the two, it'll be a first down nine out of ten times. It's first and ten. Ball on the 43-yard line. Boston College has all their DBs in for this five-wide set. Got it to him on the run. And they push him out. Wow, nice catch. Way to look at it. Heck of a job by the wide receiver. These guys are moving the ball down the field. First and 
10. And this is the fifth play of the current drive. And the man at wideout is in a zone right now. Finn move. There's a fumble. Number 76 with a recovery. Notre Dame takes a timeout. So it's second and ten. This is the sixth play of this drive. They come out with a big set. Nice play fake. He's going right. Got him on the run. Touchdown, Notre Dame. They look for the big boy on that one. And he found it with gold pocket. That guy is a load to bring down. to return. We should have a return on this one. Number 84 fields it at the three. The offense comes back on the field, hoping to build off their last drive. It's all about execution, my friends. We saw them move the football, but they were unable to move it when it mattered most. And Lee, I think you have to give credit to this defense. They tightened up when they had to, and they're going to look to do the same here. They'll set up shot at the 19. Two tight end set. On the ground with the tailback. Sheds a tackler. Tackle. The delayed handoff picks up about six yards there. It's second down and four to go. Ball on their own 25. College calls a timeout. First and ten. Ball on the 33. Number 15 is back in the gun. Drops back to pass. Steps up. Looks. Throws. And they couldn't hook up on that one. Now, who's the penalty going to be called on here? Pass on the on the defense. 15 yard penalty, first down. It's first and 10, ball right around midfield. More play now before we hit halftime, so they'll most likely throw one towards the end zone here. He fires left side. High pass, and it's caught! And that'll do it for the first half of play. Our halftime score, Boston College, 17, Notre Dame, 14.
We're ready to start the second half as the teams are lined up for the kickoff. He boots it deep downfield. Number 28 fields it in the end zone. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. They'll go to work at the 18. He drops back. Feeling the pressure. High pass, and it's caught! That was a big-time play and a new set of downs. I think the defense might have been thick and run there, Coach. Well, I don't blame him. It's pretty common to see a run on first and second down, but this offense is keeping them guessing. First and ten, ball on the 46. Notre Dame lines up in a double tight set. Back to pass. Short toss, and he dropped it. Dropped by the wideout. Number 21, the intended receiver on the play. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 46. Notre Dame goes with the ace set here. Steps up in the pocket. He tosses it short. And they make the stop. Couple of yards there. With the reception. Gain of two on the play. It's third down and eight to go. Ball on the 48. Number 10 has four receivers lined up here. There's the play fake. He throws it to the 20. He has him on the fly. That's just airing it out on third down. That was more than enough to pick up the first down. Next time, this defense will be playing on their heels. We're in the red zone. Let's have a look at the numbers. Brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone. When performance matters the most. Notre Dame comes out with an eye formation. Drops back to pass. Throws it out there. And it's caught. Just a yard there. surprised to see this defensive end wreak havoc back there. He'll dump this one off. And it's incomplete. Couldn't complete that one to his halfback. He just needed a little less air under it. Notre Dame lines up with three receivers. Back to pass. He steps up looking. To the end zone. Finds his receiver. About a seven-yard pickup that time on the pass. If he hits this, we're all tied up. He gets it up, and it's good. So here's the Pontiac drive summary to recap what just happened. Ready to kick this one off. 
Kicks it off. Number one takes it at the four. Missed tackle. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. They'll get the ball here at the 21. Two tight ends here. On the ground with the tailback. And down he goes. About four yards on that play. Second and six coming up here. Ball on their own 25. Boston College comes out with an eye formation. They go with the toss. With the throw. He has some room. Throws on the run. And he's taken down. And the trickery pays off with a nice gain and a first down. It's first and 10. Ball on the 41. Boston College sets up in the eye. He tries to spin, and they hit him in the backfield. They sent the blitz and drilled the running back before he could find any daylight. Second down and 14. Ball on their own 37. There's a the play fake. He's going right. And it's a fullback with a catch. Boy, did he zip that ball in there. Yeah, you're right. There's not a whole lot of quarterbacks out there that can make this throw. He delivers this one right where it has to be. Great arm strength. It's third down and three to go. And this is the fifth play of the current drive. The Eagle line up in a goal line formation. They'll run for the first on third and short. A little juice. Tackle. And the halfback ripped off a nice gain there to get him the first. Hey, this kid's a good-looking back. Let's see if they go to him again. First and 10. Ball on the 43. They line up in an eye. And the big fellow with some room. Brought down. He's not your ordinary fullback. This guy can move. You bet he can. I like this kid. He's a heck of a football player. They need to get him some more carries. It's first and 10. Ball on the 29-yard line. Boston College. Lines up with three receivers. They hand it off. He jukes him. Has some daylight. And down he goes. A 10 yard gain. Have a look at our Old Spice Red Zone numbers. Red Zone, when performance matters the most. There on the top. He spins. Can't wrap him up. They'll bring him down. And a huge run by the tailback. This guy's always had outstanding vision, but it seems he's got some incredible quickness as well once he gets into the open field. Boy, you're right. This kid showed me he's a great looking athlete. Come to the line with their jumbo package. And they make the stop. They get a yard on the play. One yard gain on the play. This is the kind of running back who can make you pay when he's in the zone. They're going to 
can't pitch it. Little shake and bake move. Breaks one. And down he goes. Didn't get anything. the end of quarter number three here with one quarter to go. We're all tied up. They put everyone up on the line. Little handoff. Touchdown, Eagles. Nice little run there by the halfback to get in for the score. Yo, that guy was not about to be stopped. He really wanted to get into the end zone. And he tacks on the extra point. So with under five minutes to go here in the fourth, the score, Boston College, 24, Notre Dame, 17. Turn on this one. Number 28 fields it in the end zone. The offense ready to go again. And their last drive ended with three points. They'll take over at the 18-yard line. Notre Dame comes out with an eye formation. On the ground, up the middle. Tackle. A couple of yards there by the tailback on the counter. Gain of two on the play. It's second down and eight to go. Ball on their own 20. This defense is looking to their impact corner to make a play. Drops back to pass. He's looking. Pressure coming. With the throw. The ball is tipped. Incomplete pass. Way to keep your head on a swivel, kid. That was a nice job of locating the football and knocking it down to prevent the completion. Sure was, coach. He put himself in great position to make a play. Third and eight. Ball on the 20. The Irish set up in the gun. Steps up. Looks. He's going left. And it's the senior. And he's tackled. Yeah, we got an injured player on the field. He's holding his knee in obvious pain. I hope it's not as bad as it looks. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 41. Number 10 lines up with five wide out. Looking, throws this one out to the left. He led his wide receiver too far to the outside. Yeah, he just had to pull the string a little bit more there. So it's second and 10. This is the fifth play of this drive. And the leader of the defense at corner is in the zone right now. Juke move. He's got an opening. Inside the 30, to the 20, to the 10. He's all the way home. Touchdown. What a run. That's his second rushing touchdown of the game.
PAT. But with less than four minutes to go here in the fourth quarter, our score, Notre Dame, 24, Boston College, 24. Looks ready to kick this one off. Here's the kick. Number one, fields it at the two. The offense ready for the first play of this drive. They moved the ball extremely well on their last possession on their way to the end zone. They'll start this drive at the 27-yard line. Boston College comes to the line with three wide. down. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. One yard gain on the play. Second and nine. Ball on the 28. Number 15 with three wide receivers. They hand it off again. They'll bring him down. And the delayed handoff works for a big game. Got to be happy with the effort there by your tailback. You are absolutely right. It's first and ten. Ball on the 40. One man backfield. They'll throw on first down. He's looking. Under pressure. They'll make the sack. They get to the quarterback and end that play before it even got started. This young man didn't even have a chance to make something happen. It's tough to find your receivers when the defense is in your face like that. Second and long coming up here. Ball on their own 34. Ace backfield. Back to pass. Looks. Down the middle. Incomplete, and he overthrew his wide receiver. I don't know too many seven-foot guys play football, so maybe he should aim lower the next time. Third down and a couple miles here, and this is the fifth play of the current drive. Six DBs in the lineup. He drops back, looking across the middle. Finds his receiver, and he's taken down. Good job of attacking the coverage to keep the drive alive. That was a great-looking pass to move the sticks on third down. First it's first and ten, and this is the sixth play of the drive. This impact tailback would love nothing more than to have the ball in his hands right now. Throws on the run. Tackle. I'm sure they were looking to get more than that with that play call as the trick play only nets them a few. It's second down and eight. Ball on the 41-yard line. One man back to you. They keep it on the ground with the tailback. Here he goes. They'll bring him down. And that one goes for a big, big first down. You know, every time you run the ball successfully like that, that defense starts to creep up a little bit. That's when you go to the air, my friend. Over the top. Two minutes remaining in the fourth quarter. Number 15 comes to the line with three wide. Again, he'll get the call. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Excellent play by the defense that time as they swallowed him up before he got back to the line. It's more like they devoured him. He had no shot of breaking clean. So it's second and ten. Ball in the 29. Boston College lines up with three receivers. And he's tackled. The halfback picks up a yard. One yard. Hey, 
The defense will try to stop this third down as they were unsuccessful the first time on this drive. Washington College comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. He's rolling left. And he's going to be sacked for a loss. Notre Dame takes a timeout. looking he passes it it falls incomplete they couldn't convert that fourth down but look at these guys out there they are fired up now let's see if it's going to lead to any points they'll go to work at the 32 Notre Dame goes with the ace set here with the throw has it to the senior Notre Dame calls a timeout. Second and seven coming up here. Ball on their own 35. Notre Dame lines up with three receivers. Looks. He's going right. Oh, great. He might have a chance. Now that was a good looking play. The quarterback put it where his receiver could get it, and now they have a first down. What I like is the faith that this quarterback has in his receiver. He's not afraid to throw it downfield. They like to run this fast-paced kind of offense. Yeah, and sometimes you get the defense to panic and waste the time out there. On the ground with a tailback. Brought down. And he goes over the century mark with that run, guys. You know, Brad, he's had a great day, but credit the offensive line for fine blocking all game long. The impact player at running back is in the zone right now. Jake's off a tackle. And they make the stop. Picked up big yards there, and he's going to have a first down. Yeah, nice job there. This guy does a good job in reading his blocks and accelerating through the holes. The Irish come out in the ace formation. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Bounces off the would-be tackle. And he's taken down. We've got a flag down on the field. Might have been offside. All sides, home defense. Five-yard penalty, still The defender down. beat the snap that time. Yep, you can see his fingers twitching in his stance, ready to pounce. And since we're in the red zone, let's have a look at the numbers. Brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters the most. They're in the red zone again, but this time they should be thinking touchdown. Fires to the end zone. Batted ball. Good job there by the defense to get a hand on it. It was, Kirk, but when you're going out for a pass and the ball is in the air, you need to go after it and come down with it. You just can't watch the defender bat it down. Second and five coming up here. Ball on the 18-yard line. The impact corner is in the zone right now and looking to take away half the field. And down he goes. That's the end of the fourth quarter, and we are headed to overtime. Some of the folks at home may not know how college overtime works, so I'm going to run down the rules for you. Each team will get the ball at the 25-yard line with a chance to score. If the game is still tied after both teams have had the ball once, we'll do it all over again. And remember, if this goes past double overtime, each team must go for two if they score a touchdown. No more extra points. On the ground with a tailback. They make the stop. A two-yard run by the halfback. It's second down and eight. Ball on the 23-yard line. They keep it on the ground.
ground with a tailback. Tries to juke. Brought down. That was a pretty good run. Incredible effort there, running the football by this guy. The pressure turns up when in the red zone, and that's when you turn to Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters the most. Notre Dame sets up in the eye. Gets the ball. No, they fake. Wants to throw outside. Superb catch by the wide receiver for the score. on the extra point. Find folks at Pontiac bringing us this summary of how that drive took place. Let's see if they can answer the call here. Well, the big thing here is patience. There's not a game clock. You've got a fresh set of downs to work with. you just got to take your time and don't risk turning the ball over. It's first and ten. Ball on the 25-yard line. from the shotgun. Back to pass. Throws it to the outside. And that one's fallen incomplete. Whoa! That was a bullet. A bullet that landed incomplete. I don't care. That was some impressive arm strength. Second and ten. Ball in the 25. The Eagle line up with two tight ends. They go with the run. He might have a chance. He jukes the five. Touchdown, BC. The halfback got the call and was able to carry it to Pater. Yeah, looking smooth out there. He's one of those guys they can count on for big plays. So here's the Pontiac drive summary to recap what just happened. We've got a dandy here, folks. We're heading to overtime number two. It's first and ten. Ball on the 25-yard line. Boston College comes to the line. Only one man in the backfield. Two tight end set. On the ground with the tailback. Tackle. They get three yards on the play. Second and seven, ball on the 22. Boston College comes out with two tight ends. And he's tackled. That'll be a gain of three yards.
Fisher turns up when in the red zone, and that's when you turn to Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters the most. Boston Pollard comes out in the shotgun. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. And it looks like he got the first down. I'll tell you what, Brad, that is very close. I didn't think he was going to make it there, Coach. Kirk, I agree with you 100%. I thought he would stop short, too. This kid shows some real determination on that one. The Eagle go with the eye formation. Here's the give. And he's going to lose yards on this one. That blitz couldn't have worked any better for the defense or any worse for the offense. Second down, 15 to go. This is the fifth play of this drive. They come out in a nickel. On the ground with a tailback. Broke away from one, and he's taken down. A seven-yard run by the running back. out to the right side fires and it's incomplete <laughs> trying to take the lead by a field goal here comes the special teams unit it's up and it is good and now we'll take a look at the Pontiac Drive Summary. So they'll have to keep them out of the end zone here if they want to stay alive. Yeah, the defense really needs to focus here. It's first and ten. Ball in the 25. Notre Dame lines up in a shotgun set. Drops back to pass. He's looking. Throws to the middle. Incomplete pass. Dropped by the wideout. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 25-yard line. Notre Dame sets up with four receivers. Back to pass. Looks. Lost the ball. Fumble. It's scooped up, and it's the lineman that's got it. And they got him for a loss. Third down, and what they didn't want to get in. Ball on the 33-yard line. The Irish line up with three wide. He drops back, steps up, looking. He unloads it. And it's complete for the touchdown. The wideout made a great catch for the score. Actually, I'm even more impressed with the throw. He hung in there and delivered a beautiful ball.
Folks, it's been a lot of fun, and I hope you can join us again next time. Our final score on this one, Notre Dame 37, Boston College 34. Brad Nessler for Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreit signing off. So long, everybody.